Hello Capricorn, welcome to another love reading. Today's love reading will be all about the person that you're thinking about, connecting with, and what are their energies, thoughts, feelings towards you and towards the connection. What do they secretly want to tell you? What messages do they have for you? And let's jump in. For Capricorn, for Capricorn Spirit. Who or what is coming towards Capricorn in love? Who or what is coming towards Capricorn in love? The devil reverse. So you're showing up in your own reading. First card out. So something's no longer affecting you like it once did. This is uh, getting out of a negative energy, breaking free of an unhealthy attachment. Yeah, the Hermit Virgo energy. You've done a lot of soul searching is what I'm getting here. Uh, you're trying to figure out your next step. Maybe you've withdrawn from others. Maybe you've taken some time to do some serious soul searching like I said could be dealing with another Capricorn or a Virgo or what is coming towards Capricorn spirit judgment reverse so you got all major arcanas bottom of the deck I have the king of wands so basically the message I'm getting here and this could be you all of the, uh, your energies for Capricorn or it could be the person coming towards you when it comes to love um, I feel like this is someone that has been in a difficult situation, something that has maybe become unhealthy, maybe the attachments are unhealthy, maybe there's toxicity, um, just some wrong choices have been made here. Someone's judgment was blocked, maybe they weren't aware of it, but I feel like they're aware of it now with the Hermit. They're waking up to this, this fact, right? Seeking... Um, answers trying to figure out their next steps their next moves so i have the king of wands here behind that i have the ace of cups so i feel like this is in re regards to love so let's get some more information let's get some energy oracles here spirit give me some insight what's the energy surrounding capricorn at this time what do we need to know about what's coming towards them in love deep regret yep this is what I'm picking up there's regret over past actions now again this could be you having these regrets or someone connected to you tell me more the energy surrounding Capricorn in regards to love. This is the Enchanted Map Oracle. All of my decks are linked down in the description box. Deep Freeze. Yes, there is a coldness here. I'm also getting like someone frozen in place, unable to move. There is a detachment here and notice how in the hermit card in this deck there's like snow there's this is like a very cold scene as well so I think this is this is all connected you know bottom of the deck listening exactly this is what someone has been doing they've been listening to their heart listening to their intuition their intuition is speaking to them in some way here you get one more for Capricorn, please. For Capricorn, please. What insight can you give me into their love life? Free yourself, exactly. Bottom of the deck, new love. 
This is that devil reverse energy. You're breaking free of something. You're regaining control. This is all connected. This could be a very specific reading. You know, if it resonates for you, then let me know in the comments. If it doesn't, then I understand. You know, not every reading will be for you. But I feel like this is a very important message. Tell me more, sir. Let's clarify these. Tell me more. For the sign of Capricorn, please. Give some clarity to these energies, sir. We have all major arcanas. These are major energy shifts that are happening. Tell me about the devil reverse. It's the devil reverse. Knight of Wands reverse. Hold on. That one flew. Oh man, the Five of Wands. Upright, it fell upright on the ground. Yeah, there's been conflict here. Um, this Knight of Wands reverse is just someone that you can't really trust, can't rely on. Um, drama, there's arguments. Can you get one more for the Devil reverse? I feel like this is the energy you've been in recently. This isn't you, this could be your person. Eight of Cups reversed. Maybe you've been trying to leave this situation and it has been difficult. Wow, we have the tower at the bottom of the deck. So something has happened. Something has forced you to get into this hermit energy. Tell me about the hermit. Tell me about the hermit, please. Yep, the chariot, and we have the two of cups reversed. So there must have been a separation here, a disconnect of some sort. We have cancer energy with the chariot. Um, you could have literally gone somewhere, somewhere far away, moved, or left somewhere. Because um, I have the chariot here, so this could be some sort of travel. But this is all about moving forward. I feel like a lot of you are thinking about your next steps. How to move forward from maybe a separation here, something that, you know, wasn't good. Tell me more about the Hermit. Knight of Cups Reverse. Yeah, there's disappointment. Heartbreak here with the Knight of Cups Reverse. I'm also getting like someone tried to prevent you from leaving or they emotionally keep you attached here or stuck in some way. Tell me about judgment reverse. I don't think you were able to see this for a while. Yep, four of cups reverse. This is a change of heart. Um, you've changed your mind about something. Have the emperor reverse. Um, you're opening yourself to new opportunities, whereas before you maybe were closed off here. This is you seeing things differently because the Four of Cups, when it's upright, it's almost like you can't see anything around you. Um, you can only focus on other things or <clears throat> the Three Cups here. You can't focus on anything new, anything outside of your circle, I guess you could say. So I feel like this this has been some sort of wake up call for you. The Emperor reverse. Aries energy. This is someone that feels powerless. Lacks courage. I have the tower again. This tower is very important. Yeah, and it was a difficult tower. We have the three of swords after that. Whatever this shakeup was, it was very important. Tell me more about the Judgment card reverse. Yeah, Ten of Wands. So I feel like you were holding on to something that should have been dropped all along. That's the message I just got, and I don't even want to clarify it. <laughs> I feel very um, 
I feel like that message hit me like a ton of bricks for like a reason. This is something that someone has been carrying for a long time and it could be related to home, family, marriage possibly for some of you. But someone here, it's almost like they're realizing they should have dropped this. Let's get some insight into your person. Spirit, give me some insight into the person that Capricorn is dealing with. What can you tell me about this other person? Because one of you is having regrets. Wow, the two of cups reversed. Tell me more about this person. They could have been the cause of the breakup or the separation. The chariot reverse. Interesting. So this person, there's no movement with them with the chariot reverse. Um, it's almost like they don't they don't want to move on from the separation. Maybe because you are exactly what they want. Yeah, Five of Cups reverse. So this is about recovering what they've lost. Interesting. Tell me about this person that Capricorn is dealing with using my Stellar Energy Oracle deck. Okay, we got, okay. <laughs> past life and burning heart. Yeah, that's not 10 of wands. Memories, past life, nostalgia. You've had a connection with this person in the past. This could be an X here. And burdens weigh heavy on the heart. So this person could be, could be this burden in some way. You know, the past is a burden is kind of what I'm getting here. But let's move on here and find out where all of this is headed in the near future here. Actually, let me for Capricorn and this other person. Where's all of this headed in the near future, please? Okay. Where's all of this headed for Capricorn and this other person? Six of Pentacles. Rebalancing, giving and taking. The Emperor reversed. So the Emperor showed up reversed twice. Where's all of this headed? It's like someone wants to take charge, wants to rebalance, but maybe they're not they're not able to. Yeah, four of wands reversed. Bottom of the deck, death. So an ending here, possibly in a home situation. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, a Leo. I have here five of wands. Once again, strength. Someone being strong, wanting to be strong after an ending. Let's clarify. Because this six of pentacles could be that someone wants to restore balance. Or it could be that the feelings are not mutual. There's an imbalance, right? Someone's giving more than the other. Tell me more about these energies. Let me clarify for it. For Capricorn, please. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Knight of Swords reverse. This could be deception, verbal conflict. All the Knights have shown up reverse. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. And they're all showing up reverse. This one with a Two of Cups reverse and this one with a Five of Wands. So it's almost like <laughs> the communication or the, whatever's being brought, it's, it's only causing problems. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. Justice. Yeah, this is someone that wants to restore balance, wants to make things right. Libra energy. And there's a tower reversed. So, page of cups reversed. So I feel like this is um, someone that could be wanting to avoid a tower 
or perhaps this tower already happened and now they want to fix things. But I feel like the communication is terrible or perhaps they're not being completely open or honest about, you know, about whatever they're saying in order to fix something, basically. Justice is here to make things right. So if something wasn't fair to you, here's justice. Um, but because I have the Six of Pentacles here, I feel like this is someone trying to restore justice, trying to, you know, balance things out here. Now that the tower has fallen, you know, it's like um, I'm getting this energy of, um, what's that? What's that phrase? Damage control. Tell me about the Emperor Reverse. Tell me if this is resonating in the comments. Because I feel like this is a very specific reading. Tell me about the Emperor Reverse. Yeah, Nine of Swords. Stress, anxiety, fear. Okay, we got these two. Ten of Pentacles Reverse, Ace of Cups Reverse. Yes, this Emperor is not doing well. I don't know if this... I, I have a feeling this is your person. But... um. You know, have judgment here at the bottom upright. So I feel like you're realizing something here that's not working out. Ace of Cups reverse, Ten of Pentacles reverse. Something's not stable. Yeah, and I feel like um I feel like there's 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 genuine fear here and and heartbreak. I don't know what's happened, but whoever's feeling this deep regret, I feel like they want a second chance with the judgment card. They want things to go back the way they were, or they're having a realization about how bad things have gotten. I feel like this could be um, regarding a long-term commitment for a lot of you. Tell me about the Four of Wands reverse. Seven of Wands, resistance, standing firm. Tell me about the Four of Wands reverse. The Magician Reverse. There's opposition here. To someone manifesting something. Yeah, Five of Wands again. Again, I feel like this is just like a battle here. Like, this is like a battle here. And it's preventing someone from manifesting something. There could also be uh, multiple people involved here in some way that are in the way. So, and what's happening in the near future, what I'm seeing is someone wanting to restore balance. I'm seeing someone stressed out at the fact that they don't have control over the situation. I see some sort of fighting or opposition here. Tell me about this magician reverse. What's this about here? What's the Magician Reverse about? Why is the Magician Reverse in relation to what? Yeah, this is someone wanting to get their wish fulfilled. I think this is your person, but it could also be you being prevented from... No, this is your person. Your person wants to have the fighting be over, wants to reconcile here. But if for some reason, they're not getting their wish. And then I have the world at the bottom of the deck. So it's almost like wanting a new beginning here with the past. You know, recover something, have like a union here. Um, but I'm not sure if you're open to this. You'll have to let me know in the comments. But I feel like this is a lot of you are kind of ready to free yourselves. Um... To have a new beginning here another story i'm getting you know if this is a third party situation where there's someone else involved um then i can see that your person is kind of working on becoming free themselves free of the past in some way in order to have a new beginning with you restore balance with you but they're stressed because they cannot make it happen um, and there's regrets over the fact that they've gotten themselves in this situation in the first place. I do see that being a, part, a potential storyline here. Um, so, you know, feel free to flip it if it resonates more. But that's the message I'm getting. Um, 
All right, Capricorn. So I'm going to leave it here. Uh, thanks again to everyone who has um, been supportive of the channel. Feel free to hit the like button and subscribe if you want to support the channel for free. Uh, leave me a comment if this resonated for you. And I'll see you all hopefully very soon in another video. Take care.